Good afternoon. Welcome to the Midday Mole for Wednesday, the 28th of June. Following Robert Murray McShane's reading scheme, we reach the end of Deuteronomy, reading chapters 33 and 34. And at the end of 34, it says the following, uh, Moses is about to go up on the mount, mountain and, and die, and God will bury him. And we're told, since then, no prophet has risen in Israel like Moses, whom the Lord knew face to face, who did all these miraculous signs and wonders the Lord sent him to do in Egypt, to Pharaoh and to all his officials and to his whole land. For no one has ever shown the mighty power or performed the awesome deeds that Moses did in the sight of all Israel. And I thought, here yeah, they, they, they recognized the power that Moses had and these mighty deeds, these signs that he'd performed, and no one had repeated them. It hadn't happened again until Jesus. And Moses had promised that God would raise up another prophet like himself. And Jesus comes along, and he does greater miracles than Moses did. And you think of all that Moses did for the people, Jesus did the same. And uh, which is why when John writes his gospel and he talks about the miracles, he, he calls them signs because they point to who Jesus is. And so I can believe uh, Israelites would look back to Moses and say there was the greatest prophet. And then you see Jesus and you say here is one even greater than Moses because not only has he done the same signs and wonders, he's done more of them. And then he, the greatest of all is his death and resurrection. And so we have not only a prophet, but we have a high priest. Not only a high priest, but we have a brother and a friend in Christ. So hang on to him, <laughs> walk with him, trust in him. Know that in the same way that Moses, with the signs and wonders, led the people to the promised land, Jesus leads us through the wilderness that we live in in this world to the promised land in eternity. So we just need to keep listening, keep following, keep trusting. In that way, our future is secure and we are blessed.